Hi, this is Shraddha, Dermatologist at Helios and in continuation with our awareness initiative on PCOS, today we will be talking on um, endocrine disruptors. Now these endocrine disruptors are chemicals that we come across in our day-to-day -day, uh, life and uh, these chemicals bind to the hormone receptors and they can alter our hormone levels. They can either decrease it or increase it. Now what are these chemicals? Common are atrazines which are actually herbicides which is uh, used to prevent uh, weeds in used in sugarcane crops and uh, we also have commonly BPAs, bisphenols which are commonly seen in packaging items, in plastic bottles, in plastic covers and toys. So these BPAs are known to produce, there is recent evidence also in literature saying that BPAs do cause polycystic ovary syndrome and uh, that levels of BPAs are quite elevated in the blood and urine and also in the fluid of the cysts. There is also dioxins which are byproducts of bleaching of paper. There are perchlorates which are uh, uh, seen in those with the manufacturing explosives and uh, firecrackers. Then there is PFAs which are seen in non-stick pants. Then phthalates which are seen commonly in cosmetics like your hair foams, your nail polishes your uh, aftershave lotions, so one must look for such uh, contents. Then phytoestrogens which are also plant derived, uh, derived from soy foods and that can uh, mimic your estrogen and uh, your triclosan which is very commonly used in antibacterial soaps earlier. So all these chemicals can be uh, hormone disruptors. So one must look out for these ingredients in your uh, day to day products uh, so you can avoid them.